Good day. Today is April 15th. Our devotion is taken from Acts chapter 16 verse 14. One of those listening was a woman from the city of Thyatira, Lomladenia, a dealer in purple cloth. The Lord opened her heart to respond to Paul's message. Acts 16 14. Lydia's faithfulness. This passage is the only place in the Bible where Lydia is mentioned. Other than her hometown, Thyatira, and her occupation, we know nothing about her. Why, then, did Luke, the writer of Acts, choose to mention her? Many scholars believe it was because she was one of Paul's first converts, perhaps his very first. However, there is more to learn about Lydia if we look at her more closely. When learning about Lydia, zero in on her occupation. She was a dealer in purple cloth. Purple cloth was a rarity in ancient Israel. Only royalty and the upper echelons of the upper class could afford or wear it. In addition, the indigo dye used to make purple cloth was rare in itself. Producing purple was a long and arduous process that involved working in suffocating, odorous dyeing sheds. The Bible tells us that Lydia dealt in purple cloth meaning not only that she made it, but also that she sold it for money. This signals she was a wealthy woman and a merchant, which in turn signals that she was a rare businesswoman. In what was very much a man's world, she would have every reason to believe she did not need God. She had already risen far in her world, and attained respect women only dreamed of. Yet, the Bible calls her a worshipper with an open heart. Lydia was not only rich in material possessions, but also rich in her heart. Despite, or perhaps because of, her material blessings, she knew God mattered most and was willing to be his follower, even though it might have cost her dearly. Perhaps her faithfulness is why Luke gives her special mention. Meditate on Lydia today, asking God to grant you a richness in heart.